Hey guys, it's uh, firstly 17th of August. Um, time is about 8.20, 8.25. Um, back at Tenton Lock today. See what I can find and recover the uh, the Fun Bros Magnet. Uh, I actually watched their video and uh, I was on the wrong part. I was further up. All I did come down this area. But um, looks like that's down this area, and I don't know if I'm going to get it because it's out there. So um, I'm just going to see how it goes. Plus, there's some people fishing, but I just don't know if I'm going to be able to try and get it back for them. It's not just that, you know. Um, I've come down because I also want to see what else I can find here because I had some really interesting stuff here the other day. So uh, we're just going to see how it goes. And those people there, a couple of days ago, those fishing guys, and by four, one of them, so I can only be here two days, I think. So, hmm. Right, now, I'm still a little bit confused because when I looked at their video, there was like a sandy or stony pathway so I'm not sure exactly where they were I don't think you go any further I think it was along here somewhere what I'm going to do is uh, check the video again and see roughly where they were. Um, if I can find any kind of like metallic objects, then maybe maybe I'll get a, an idea of where they were. I think they might be in this area actually. I think it's around about here or there. They might have lost it. So I'm going to give it a go here for about half an hour, see what happens. If not, I'll just carry on. Let's have a quick video again.
think it's over there. I'm always worked down anyway.
or something. <laughs> Whatever that is, I do not know. But there's something down there. Big piece of wood. There we go, it walked in my face already. Okay, I'm hooked. I was hooked. Something's down here. I think this might be the place. So I just got hooked up roughly where the fun bars got hooked. Come around this side. It's where it is, it's something down here. I've got something on. Oh. Fishing tackle. I think it's roughly where they lost their magnet because I've seen uh, bits of scrap metal down there.
don't know if it's here on the next one. I'm going to keep trying both anyway. Try this one for about half an hour, then I'll move on to the next one. Soaking wet. There's something down there actually. I don't think it's getting caught up on these things. I only just started and I've already got a backache. Right, let's move down to the other one. I don't think it was on this one. I think it might have been over here. I'll have to look at the video again and see if that bush was there. Let's do that in a minute. Let's have a look. 
again. So it's either in this part or the one foot further down. Now I've got no fucking internet again. Bullshit, no fucking ink in it. Well, I'm gonna just go on a light, do a long this bit today, fuck it. If I find it, I find it, if I don't, I don't. At least I tried. Get no internet. This might be fucking 4G. <laughs> no bollocks. I did get snagged on there just a little while ago. I'm trying to reconstruct the way he threw it. But I can't because of the fucking internet. Donald's be staying down this build like all the time. There's more stuff up that way. <laughs> I'm sure it's that one now. I don't remember these. I'm trying to find out if this bushy bit was here. I 
so I've got something on. Fucking another pole. Black rock. I am fucking soaking again. Chucking that a bit for away. Alright, I'm going to turn the record off, guys. If I get anything, I'll let them know. Save the battery in for memory. So, guys, uh, I just pulled the bike out here yeah, a little while ago. Uh, is this the bike that the uh, fun brother's been trying to get? I wonder. When I lost the magnet? Uh, I don't know. But I'll cook it out anyway. So anyway, I'm going back up to where I started pulling the other junk out the other day. Um, yeah, like, um, I nearly lost my magnet there just now as well. So, uh, I think it's a little bit rocky. Uh, my magnet did get stuck, but luckily, um, some guys were coming down in canoes, I asked him to unhook it, which he did do. Um, so yeah, uh, <laughs> um, I'm here now. I've just got to walk up a little bit to uh, a little section I did the other day. Now I've got a load of crap out. So I couldn't put me in the bin because I didn't know where the bin was, but now I know where there is a bin. I can actually put whatever I dig out into a bin later. She saw this stuff I pulled out the other, the other day. Then, tin, bolt, cheese grater, and a metal plate. But I did have other stuff up there. Um, which you might have saw on my last video. And that I've got 
well that I've chucked away so I'm going to do here again for a bit and see what happens just hope I don't lose my magnet again looks like a lot of seaweed's been uh, it's actually floating up now why I don't know but I'm not too worried about that so what time is it? I don't know what the time is even quarter past eleven I've decided to come today because um, I'm going to visit my mum tomorrow and uh, maybe in a little while I might put my other camera up which I might do that now having a camcorder recording There's my tripod There's my camcorder That. Right, let's see what we can get out of here again. I'll start on this part. Work down probably. Got some bits. Right, it's got a bit tangled up. Where's that go? I actually pulled out um, this, it's got tangled up. Pull this out. Got a broken lip on it, but I've got one a little bit like that, but more softer plastic. It's actually getting a bit warm. Nuts, a uh, couple of nails.
Sometimes the guys who help me out get my get the uh, magnets off. I think he was actually going to do it to be on the show. I'm on site heavy and it come off. Oh, hang on, I've got some ink. Oh, it's come off. <coughs> I don't think it's metal actually, I think it's something wood. There's like a big branch down here. Over now. Pull this in one until I go past. Alright. Cheers again for that. pair of gloves, these ones are soaking wet. Mary Gold. I might just spend about an hour here. Oh, Yeah, so I might spend about an hour here, um, and then go back to Kingston. Oh. So I know there's something down here. 
but what it is I don't know. I don't know if it's metallic. I think I've got something. Yep. It's like an old mooring pig. Yeah, I think now. Yeah, it's not coming up. Okay, a chisel. Got a uh, wood, wood chisel blade. I'm not keeping it. Anything I find today, I probably might just leave here, unless it's something unusual. I've got way too much stuff indoors. Move this down a little bit. Little moth down there. Trying to swim. I think I've got it on. Yeah, I've got something come. Oh, it's come off. Whatever it is is heavy. I 
down, no. on bracket. <laughs> Probably from the mooring. That was heavy. <sighs> Bust my back nearly. It's still more I think down here. Come in, so I know it's going to be more down here. If it does, I might have to move. Or something again. Yep. Cool stuff down it, but I don't know if it's rocks, branches, or mechanic. Okay, something on. Come on, something. It's like when you're fishing. Fish on, magnet on. Big iron bar. Oh. Holy shit. <laughs> and a jumper. Oil down there, so it's like oily. Just come off something.
nail, cut a bit of scrap of metal. Over there, and clouds all over there. Scrap metal and a clothes peg. up near the bridge in the little for half hour. That's if that boat don't moor up there. Got a lot of nails. Every one was a nail. Broken saucepan and a battery.
I've got something on. Please don't be. I don't know. It's far, but it fell off. Cold coat, still iron, whatever. Not had no coins today. I thought that's coin, but it's a nut uh, washer. Right, I'm going to move up. I'm afraid I can't do anything with that um, stuff there, there ain't no bins around here. I'll just leave it there, hopefully uh, one of the um, council bin guys will come around and collect it. I'll keep it like tied anyway. Time to move down. Bags already torn up as well. Man, the bags I'll keep going through. Right. Down towards the bridge. So the camera's a bit wonky on the camcorder. This is what I pulled at two days ago. 
Near the bait is split. Someone's been here and smashed the bottle up. Someone's been here because there's a uh, rusty nail, rusty stuff. One ball cap, 30 foot, 30 foot export. I think I need to come off. Right, it's gone there. If I hit this side of the thingy. And throw it away. Dim the rain. So it was raining, I think rain today.
metal stuff. Don't know where it is. It's like a squash pulley. Bit of a bike chain. Oh, thank God for that. It's something every day now. It's very heavy. Barbed wire. something Treading rope.
this way. Two one piece. First coins today. Thanks, yeah. No. Snacking, no. Got this. So I'm not swearing over there. There's me something there. Oh, ten feet. It's too free. No, if it's not snapping. I have to use the hook as well.
Estamos en la justa, no te ves. Every day now. It's only been for months. I don't know what it is, it just keeps coming off. Might be a thin piece of wire. Right guys, I'm going to turn the cameras off a little while. If I get it, I'll let you know. I want to save the batteries. So, so I'm not sure why my camera shut off, but it did. And I've got another bike here. Racer. Three bikes today. I bet there's more out there as well. Spinner on here. Little spinner. What's he doing?
go again. Ah. Right, I'm gonna need to grab him for this one. There's definitely another bite there. Not seem to find it though.
I was saying I'll stay in a minute ago, but I can't find it now. I thought it might have been a full fight. Just another bike. I guarantee you it's another bike, guys. Get a clip on it. I'm sure it's another bike. Might throw the hook in a minute. It's coming slowly. Of a what's the name? Um, mud guard, so it means it is another bike. It's got to be. Just can't get a grip on it now. But it spokes. If I try it that way, it might work. I'm losing. Can't find it now.
right now. Try the hook again. It's definitely there. The magnet and catching on it just like it did on the other two. on it. Oh, you fucker, come off. Hook was on it then. I think I've got it. Yeah. Another bike. Huh. <sighs> Another two down there. Wow. I can't get rid of them, I just have to leave them here for the uh, trash man to get it. Now? Yeah, we're in the matter of about 10 minutes of each other. Been in there a while. I don't believe another bike. <laughs> Any more? That's four bikes today, guys. Anymore. Can he? Certainly, please. Well fun bros, you watching this dude? Four bikes. And I bet there's more here. I guarantee there's more. <coughs> Best you bring your gravelling hook down here. Start getting these bikes out. <laughs> They've probably just been nicked and thrown over the bridge.
bit of smoke. Hello. That could be another one. No one here. Yeah, something right there. It's gone. Oh, she got me up with stuff now. Gravelling hook. <laughs> I've just pulled all these bikes out and no one caught up on. I don't know if it's another bike or big rock. Yeah, at the moment. <laughs> no, I don't think so. I'm going to have to just see if I can walk down and pull it. Yeah, I've just lost milk now though. It's got stuck. Milk's got stuck. Oh, it's off now. <laughs> yeah, there's something down. I don't know what it is. I thought it might be a bike, but I don't think it is because. Yeah, there's one. I pulled one out down there as well. So that's four bikes I pulled out since this morning. 
<laughs> not neck. <laughs> My back aches. <laughs> Oh, I've got me a book. Got me a book back. I don't think I tried it. I don't think that's a bike. I think that's either brick, concrete, or something else. Could be more than one bike down there. I'm on something again. I don't know what it is. Oh, just a piece of metal, I think. Something down there as well. Something big. Nothing. Wish it was a bike which is in good condition. Be able to ride it home. <laughs> Thing is, I've got one. Get it so the hook is facing a certain way. That's it, it's on it. Oh, it's come off. I'm telling you, it's another bike. I'm going to you. It's coming up. I told you, it's another fucking bike. And there's something that was attached to it. Or was. Well, it's part of a bike. Where's the magnet? Is it? There was a, like, a box thing to
don't know what that black thing was, but there was something else that was coming up on it. They fell back in. Worry about it. Is it? I was going to go to Kingston for a couple of hours. One o'clock nearly, ten to twelve, uh, ten to one. Not attack. Don't know where that black thing went. like a black box thing. Don't come up here for fuck's sake.
I think that black thing might have been a wooden box or something. So I ain't catching. So that's just run over something and I think that's another bike. part of that other bike. That's lighter. There's something down there, but it's not coming up. I don't know where that black thing went. I'll close this off here, but guys, get back to you. So, got another bike, guys. Bike today.
tell the locksmith, the uh, lock gate keeper, there's a whole load of bikes over there. <laughs> if also you shouldn't be doing it. I say, listen here. What the fuck you get the fucking stuff out with you? I'm getting like, a bit like the blackbird. He's falling the bites out all the time. I mean black crow, sorry. <laughs> Ron. Hello to Ron by the way. I know there's I am telling you there's more bikes here. I think that might be another one here. Before I leave, I'll go and tell those guys to pull out these bikes. <sighs> I think there's one there. Oh, smart. The wife am. Little worm. Little lantern thing. Smart. Just hope I don't break the glass. I don't know I'm going to get a shell out though. Little, little lantern, nice little treasure. I'm 
I'd find more stuff treasure wise than that, and I pulled all these bikes out. And they give me a gun or something. Hi. Hi. So I'm magnet fishing and I'm just gonna just pull that. Yeah. Yeah. Oh right, you get stuff out of the you what you find in there, isn't it? Four bikes there. No. And one down there. Pulled them out within the last half hour. Yeah. Is that, are you working for the council then? No. <laughs> I'm, I'm doing it on my own, like from the tweet. It ain't just me, there's another guy who comes down with his kid. Yeah. He it's lost not it. Hard, is it? Just no. Just the thing is, right, when I first come down here, I said to the guy, Can I do like a bit of fishing, magnet fishing in the dock? And he goes, Oh no, you can't do it here. So if you want to do something, you have to go up that way. But I know some guy, and his son comes down here all the time on this section. So I've, I've been doing down here because he lost his magnet. I've been trying to find it, it was down that area and he was going on about a bike where he lost his uh, magnet and I found the bike but the magnet oh, right. but I just pulled those bikes out four oh, bikes good. I put it on, you know, I'm recording it as you can see because I put it on uh, YouTube yeah. so people watch they're interested <laughs> people, you know, like, you know, people in like uh, the foreign countries like Denmark and Germany they pull out Machine guns, pistols, yeah. knives, bombs, grenades. Oh. <laughs> well, don't, don't pull any of those out, please. <laughs> if I do, I'll probably oh. be the first one to go anyway. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Alright, we're just walking up there. We'll come back and see how much we've got. Yeah, well, I've got, I might have to go up there actually and tell them I've pulled these out. Right. The locksmith. He might not even bother worrying about it. He might just say OK and not do nothing about it. So I don't think there's a phone number here for. Um, like this environment agency, but there's no phone number. Oh, right. So, Okay, I've just snagged on something there. I think that's another bike. Bit of a chain. I'm telling you, there's more bikes now. I know it. I might not go to Kingston. Well, I've got to go to Kingston on the way home, but. I know there's another bike here. Gut feeling, my gut feeling always tells me when I'm right and wrong. Yeah. That's paint. I'm sure I felt something just down here. There's a magnet running over. One of the spares! <laughs> I think there's another one here. Feeling something. Yeah. Got something. Oh, not another one of these. Oh shit. That's two, I'll just put that, that one. And I've just got another one out over there somewhere.
I was just hoping one of the bikes might have been in very good condition. It's only been put in there a day or two, then I could have rode it home all the way to Mitchum then. <laughs> I mean, they have been in there a long time. With all the, you know, look, it's all rusted up. A little kid's bike there. The handles don't even turn. Now we've got a racer. All clothes, I might, like, you know, clothes attached to them. Why, well, I don't know. Pants. I pulled a, a bike out down there and had like a, a thick sweater. I ain't gonna, I ain't got no way to get rid of him. I've got, I'll have to ask him at the lock if he's got a, a number where someone can come down to collect him. <laughs> I know where I'm gonna be able to take him. <laughs> I ain't got a car though, you know. And I wouldn't be surprised because well, you shouldn't be doing that anyway. Because I, I tried doing it down there about three weeks ago. I said, Can I do the lock here? He said, No. He goes, You can't do it here, you go further down. But if, some guy who I, I don't actually know the guy personally but he, he does the same thing and he comes down here and he's, he's never like been kicked off or anything and I, I can't see why they say no anyway when we're pulling more shit out yeah well youngsters shouldn't be jumping off the bridge anyway <laughs> I was told though in the um, spring or winter all this water disappears because the tide goes out or something. Yeah, they, they um, open the gate. Yeah. And um, it's just the water that goes out and the gate that goes out and the Oh, right. So what part, what part of the year is that then? Sorry? What part of the year is that? I, I, I think it's in the spring though. Yeah, when, when spring I don't know. Yeah, <laughs> I, I don't know. <laughs> I'd have to look on the internet. Because yeah. I was told that they actually... Um, the last guy we know. Yeah. And as I say, the other side, it's in the Yeah, someone told me that, like, you know, springtime they emptied it for two or three weeks or something, let the tide go out. Lots of metal stuff on the other side, by, you know, the slipway on the other side? Yeah. At the end of the slip where it drops off, there's loads of tide in America. Who is there? Well, I ain't going to go there today. The tide will slow down. It doesn't go right out here, this is, this is the main tide of it. Yeah. Well, I've been up to Richmond, like, you know, there's a bike and I pulled out four shopping carts out there and four chairs. The shopping carts are left along the um, sideway and I didn't go back there for a couple of days. When I did go back, they'd gone and I thought it might have been the um, the garbage man, you know, the one that goes down collecting all the rubbish from the bin. He might have, like, reported it and got him picked up, but I don't think so because, like, when I've been going down there, I keep getting snagged and when I'm like pulling it in you can see the shopping trolleys and everything. Yeah, yeah. So I like your big magnet. I've got one, Seabird's the one, but it's not a Yeah, that one's um 140k pull. But you can get a smaller one which I want to get, um Medillion one, which is like well 250 or 500k, but they're like 250 is about 60 quid I think, and the 500 is about 80 quid. And that will pull out a bike without no problem. Yeah, I'm going to get a winch as well. So I've already been hooked up twice. I had to uh, stop a guy on a boat um, and ask him to like release me magnet, which he did do. Otherwise, I'll have been home by now. <laughs> but if you need any parts. <laughs> I wish I knew what that black thing was. 
That might have been a box of money or something. Yeah. Getting a bit warm. One minute it's hot and the next minute it's cold. On a bike? Do you need to repair anything? I don't think you could even make one bike out of them for you four. All rusted up, the wheels are gone. Brakes are seized. Just along here. Yeah. I got snagged up on my hook a little while ago and I didn't know what it was and I had to walk down and I was able to release it. But sometimes the magnet will go under the bike and it'll drag it in and as you try to bring it up the magnet comes off. So I've got this like I pulled this out the other day, so I'm using this to and bring it back up. If I know there's another one down here, I can I can feel it touching it. I can't remember if it's this side or this side. I've got something on here. What is it? Oh, a piece of metal. A few bits of pieces of metal. Drink again a minute. Find something now. Something else there, it fell off. Hello. Alright, close this off again, guys.
bit of back later. Right, I'm going to do another bike I think guys. We've got the hook on it. Yep, another bike. Oh, for this way. Oh, God. Six bikes. <laughs> I'm going to get rid of these, I'll have to go to the locks, locks uh, the lock guy and ask him for a phone number or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They probably like nicked them and dumped them. Yeah, yeah. For a moment of the bridge. What size are you uh, 140k pull. Um, just stabbed myself. Uh, yeah, 140k pull on that one. And then... No, I'm going to save up for one. Um, but I've been pulling them in like that for a little bit, but the magnets tend to slide off. Yeah. I pulled this hook out the other day, so I've been using this. And that's been getting it out. That's not bad. So me going out and buying a, an actual... Yeah, um, yeah. So that's been helping me out. I lost the magnet the other day and I was able to get it back with that. Which was kind of weird because I got that out first. I threw the magnet in and it got stuck. And I threw that in and I managed to pull the magnet back out. <laughs> so it's kind of like salvaged for me. No, I like it. It's a good job. I was saying, I do a bit of fishing and we were talking about how much you'd want to get a snorkel and just go for people's legs and stuff that's all at the bottom of the... Um, well, that's not a bad idea, a big magnet on a... Well, a lot of the um, guys on the barges, they use that um, sea searcher. That's magnetic. Yeah. It's just the red one. It picks up, uh, I think it's like 50 kilos. Not bad. One little bit. But this one only cost me um, 24 quid. Was it? Yeah, 24 quid. The rope, 7 quid. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, you know, 30 quid. I've got some really nice, like, uh, boating tags I've got from uh, Kingston. Let me show you, you want to see them. Uh, I saw some guys selling them on eBay, similar ones. Yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, between 40 and 80 quid. That's why I pulled that down now. That's down now. You don't even see those. Yeah, yeah. 1900, the earliest one. Mm. So five of those. And I've got another one, six, two egg shaped ones. Yeah, yeah. That's a rare one, and that's a rare one, wow. and that's the up, that's the like blow up of that that one. I found yeah, that yeah. one in Kingston two days ago. No way. Where the boat and where the yacht below uh, club is, just along you've got like the pier there, and you've got another little wooden pier there. I was just like going along there, and every time I found them, that's where I found them. Yeah, yeah. And I 
I noticed that some of the wood was actually missing, so I just threw the magnet under and it caught on that smaller one. So. Do you usually find where they, uh, yeah. where they settle? Well, oh, I can't. I'm going to go and buy myself a magnet. Mm. We're saying for ages, I saw something about you know, people that go and when the tide's out, go and find all the bits that have been... Yeah, mud larking. Mud Yeah, about that's like £75 pound for three years. Yeah, that's the thing. Yeah, it's, it's interesting, like, you know... How far out are you? Are you literally just here? How far out are you chucking the... About 10 metres. All these bikes have just been like... Well, if I show you. I don't think there's another one out there. I hope not. <laughs> <laughs> um, let's get the... Make the thing up. I'll just use this as to make it. Yeah. <laughs> well, you know, there are women actually taking this up now, you know, kids and whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, let's try and sort this bike out first. <sighs> See me, mate. Well, it's not a, an actual mate. Yeah. But the, you know, don't, like, you know, the amount of punk tanks of people just jump everywhere, like, yeah. surprise me the people. No, you get like little perch, you know, little spinners and stuff. Yeah. But um, a guy who I've been watching. He goes down to the Fun Brothers on uh, YouTube, yeah, okay. and he was down here the other day looking for the bike, which I probably was the one pulled out today. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and he got his magnet uh, lodged, and he couldn't get it back. Oh. So I came down here two days ago trying to find it. You know, checking on the video, couldn't see where it was, and eventually I found out where it was because right down the bottom, where I like, kind of like leveled up where he was actually casting out yeah. I threw my magnet and I saw his rope pop up so and there's me yeah, I've managed to get his rope and I'm trying to pull it and pull it it still won't come in and I thought well I'm going to have to like leave it you know but then a group of like uh, people one bloke and about eight kids were canoeing down here so I said here mate you could do us a <laughs> favour could you he goes what's that I said I've got a magnet stuck I said if I throw you the rope can you just like pull it that way yeah, give so I can't pull it this way because it's completely stuck. So he just went yank yank and it came off. No way. And I got it in my bag. Uh, you haven't seen him yet? No, I ain't telling him yet. <laughs> <laughs> I tell him. Because when I told him, I said, you're going to go back, guys. Ah. Guys, I don't know. I've got three more magnets. I thought, oh, there we well, there we go. You know. But yeah, I'm not a dishonest person. I will probably tell him that I've got it. I'll, I'll do a photo. He'll probably say to you, oh, I can't it, Yeah, I'll say, well, if you want it back, you know, we'll meet up down at Kingston somewhere. But yeah, like, I've just been throwing the magnet out, so about there. Yeah. You know, I'll just bring it in. And, you know, after a while you get the um, the sense of what's been yeah. tugged on the rope. Yeah, yeah. And when it starts going like, you know, if, sometimes you feel yeah. like it's like gravel, but when it starts bumping you think, hmm, a it's more than gravel. And like, I'm pulling it, and now I've got five, five five bikes there and one down there and it's six. Most bikes I've ever pulled out. What, do, what, what will you do with them now? I'll have to leave them now. I'll have to go to the uh, no, lock no. gate and ask him to call someone down or, you know, yeah, or yeah. give me a phone number and I'll have to ring him up. Because there's a guy walking across here with his bike. He goes, if you go on the other side, mate, where that dip is, there's a load of bikes down there. And <laughs> oh, I thought, yeah, you think I'm going to fucking do that today? No bloody way. <laughs> I think there's going to be more bikes around this area like where they've been chucked over. Because yeah, yeah. I think some of these bikes, you know, the, the condition of them, you know, the, the water's eaten away the, the spokes. Yeah. You know, and there's no way you can actually salvage any of these. No. It's a shame because I bet you find some like that one's got a fairly funky pair of handlebars on it. Yeah. <laughs> Unless someone came down and said, hey mate, can I have them bike? Bits, you know, take them scrap. Scrap, yeah, that's Do what you make. Oh, if you're going to scrap them, hey, give the fiver, yeah, then you're, exactly. you know. That's the phone call you want to be making. Because I ride, if I drove, which I don't, I had to come down by tr public transport because I live in Mitchell. So yeah, it's yeah. like two bus rides. But if I was able to drive and I had a truck, they'd bring my truck and go yeah. down straight down to the yeah, scrap yeah. dealer. Yeah. Right, oh, I pulled out. If, you, if you're going down there, yeah. Just where that uh, this barge here, yeah. on the side, I pulled out a great fucking door, a door, and next to it there's a great big iron plate that big, which I pulled out all on my own. No I nearly way. broke my back. Oh my <laughs> God. YouTube sometimes, it's like, yeah, you know. Yeah. 
Magnet Fishing UK, yeah, but yeah, if you yeah. go onto YouTube, it's uh, Steve Fishing and Magnet Fishing. Okay. And then if you just do like Magnet Fishing Kingston, you'll probably find me there. Yeah, yeah. Because I, you know, I do all my videos on there. Wicked. So. Yeah, I'm up for a bit of that. Yeah, it's, it's <laughs> worth doing. You know, under thirty quid, you don't know. The only thing it doesn't pick up is gold and silver and platinum. But you know, you never know. Um, I found a little Dinager gun. No way. Yeah, down at um, River Wandle. It's got no barrel. It's all rusted up. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Kingston on that side where all the fishing people will fish. Uh, Fifteen two two bullets, live. Yeah, two Bowie knives that big. Uh, um, when I was down here the other day, just along here, I pulled out a great big butcher's carving knife and three other little knives. I, was, I won't go to take them home, I just went down to Kingston and ran them into the police and I put them in the yeah, yeah. drop box. Uh, I'm just I'm just saying with weapons and certain things like that, do you know what I mean? You've got to be like. Yeah. I was just waiting for that little iron box to be pulled up. Yeah. With a little padlock on, you can just knock off. And there's like gold coins and silver yeah, and jewels. Yeah. I have found some, like over um, Clapham Common, which I've got permission to do the lakes there, I actually found two bags with costume jewellery in. And it had credit cards in as well. And two credit cards were still valid. No. And like, I, I put the cards in here. And I just kept them there. I went through all the costume jewellery, picked out the ones which were, you know, in still good yeah. condition um, and I kind of threw the other ones away and as I was because it wasn't like late I can actually I actually had my whalers on and I started just walking around and every time I kicked something I put my hand down yeah. it's either a bottle or um, iron rod or something yeah, yeah. well I found these two uh, bags of uh, costume jewelry uh, they're probably about 15 meters away from each other so I went through them both picked out the ones which weren't you know which weren't badly destroyed, got the better ones, and then like about an hour later, still in the same lake, walking along, I kicked something else, and I put my hand down, another bag, it had some little costume jewellery in, an iPad, which was busted, an iPhone 4, an iPhone 5, and an iPod, I took them home and dried them out, but they won't work, the iPhone 5 fell apart as soon as I started charging, but um, you know, I had um, a handful of like, Common coins in there, which I kept. The iPhone 5 is still kept because I, you know, the glass might be okay. Yeah. Um, but yeah, like before I left, as I was sorting through them, uh, a police car was coming through the common, and I just waved him down. I said, "Here, mate, you know, you better take these." Yeah. And I gave him all the cards. The only thing I didn't take, which I should have done, was the oyster card because <laughs> it might have had money on it. <laughs> Oh, Alright then. Yeah, yeah. Alright, cheers. Good luck. Yeah. So, are we going to get one more bike? Bloody hell, that's six bikes. I can't even get to that. There. Uh. I bet they thought the trucks ain't shut up till. just went over something. I think there's another bike there now. I think there's another bike. Holy shit. Just down there. Oh crap. It's just down there. I think there's another bike down there guys. I'm looking on something. Where's that hook? Is this spike number seven?
can't seem to grab it. I think it's a, the actual hook. It's got to be facing the way the bike is. I just went over it. I thought it'd come off. <laughs> 